Leroy's Pokemon Sapphire Walkthrough, Part 15. Alright, welcome to Maville City! Now, we got a bunch of stuff to do here, but first I'm gonna heal up my Pokemon. Alright, now let's take a look at the sign here. Uh, Maville City, the bright and shiny city of fun! Alright, that's exciting. Now anyways, the first thing you probably want to do when you get here is check out this building right here. This is the cycling shop, and you'll want to get a bike because it'll make it a lot easier to get around. So, um, yeah, this is Rydal. Yeah, the name of the um, cycling shop owner is Rydal. And if you say you've come from far away, um, he will be like, Whoa, you came all the way from Little Root. That's ridiculously far. So then, just because he's so nice, he will give you a bike. I mean, just because you've came from a long ways. So then you can choose either the mock bike or the acro bike. Um, now the mock bike will go really, really fast, and the acro bike will go a bit slower, but you can do tricks on it and wheelies and stuff. Um, it really doesn't matter. Like there are certain places you can only get to using the mock bike, and certain places you can only you can only get to using the acro bike. But really, it doesn't make a difference which one you choose. Um, I'm gonna take the acro bike just because um, I kind of tend to crash a lot when I'm on the mock bike just because it's a little too fast, but yeah, so um, go to your bag when you get it and go to the key items, and then from there you can uh, click on it and choose register, and that'll make it so you can just click select to get on your bike. So yeah, that makes it a little easy, and then when you hold B you can do a wheelie if you have the acro bike. So yeah, um, oh you probably saw the gym right there, I'll get to that in a minute, but I got some other stuff I want to show you first. Um, Cause yeah, this building down, oh wait, I want to grab this item first. Alright, there's next speed. Now you will definitely want to come into this building, you definitely don't want to forget this because you're going to need to come in here in order to beat the game. So, yeah, just head into this building right here. Now, um, talk to this guy. And, yeah, I don't know what it is. I guess people in Mobile City are just really nice and like handing out free items. But yeah, this guy gives you HMO6, which is Rock Smash. And you will need that um, to, you know, smash rocks, obviously. Um, it's not that good of a move in battle, so if you have an HM slave, that wouldn't be a bad move to teach to it. So yeah, um, let's go inside this house. Now, if you remember in the last video, I told you to buy the Harbor Mail um, in Slateport City for only $50. So if you do that, you can talk to this lady, and you can exchange it for the coin case, which is a good deal because, I mean, the Harbor Mail is only $50. So yeah, give her that and you'll get the coin case, and you can use that to uh, collect coins at the game corner which is just over here, so, um, yeah, uh, this is the Modville Game Quarter. Now you can, like, play the slot machines and stuff to get coins, or you can just buy them. That's probably the easiest way to do it, um, and then you can buy a bunch of really good TMs. Probably the best way to get coins is probably just buying them, and then you can get some really good TMs, you know, like Thunderbolt, Flamethrower, Ice Beam, stuff like that. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna do all any of that right now. Um, maybe later, but for now I just want to move on. Now, you, yeah, you probably saw this gym right here, and we're definitely gonna be checking this out. So I'm gonna move, uh, Grove out front. Now you're probably wondering what these people are doing here. Um, this is actually Wally. Remember the guy that you helped, uh, catch that Ralts with? But yeah, he's talking to his dad. He doesn't even notice you're here, apparently. <laughs> he's just talking. Um, and then he finally notices you. He's like, oh, hi, Leroy. And then... Yeah, apparently he thinks he's good enough to go take on the gym, so he has to prove to his uncle that he can beat me. And that he's tough enough to take on the gym leader, Watson. So yeah, you're gonna battle him now. And this is your first battle with Wally, so it's really, really easy. He just has a roll to level 16. And I really feel bad for Wally. I mean, he's like, oh, Dad, please, I'll show you. I, I, I'm good enough to take on the gym, and then he dies in one hit. Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing. Actually, I don't know. If is, it, is it his dad or his uncle? I think it's his uncle, actually. Not his dad, but whatever. And he's just like, oh, I lost. Oh yeah, it is his uncle, not his dad, whatever. So anyways, he has to go back to his house now. He's like, oh, I still have so much training to do. And he's like, oh, it's okay, well, you'll get stronger, blah, blah, blah. And then your, uh, or the dude comes back, and then he says you should go visit him sometime, which I guess we'll have to do since they're making us, but yeah. Um, so after that, you can head inside the gym if you want, but I'm not going to do that right now because um, I'm not sure if I'm ready to take on the gym yet, so... Yeah, by the way, I'm going to come down here really quick because I forgot to pick some berries last time. Um, so let's see. What are these berries? Nanab berries. So yeah, we can pick these. And by the way, right now I'd just like to say, um, I'm really sorry. I, I know I haven't been making a lot of videos lately, so I just want to thank all you that, you know, like, have, you know, actually not been yelling at me and stuff to make more videos. But, you know, don't worry because I'll be making a lot more soon. 
Maybe not in the next few days because I have a lot of stuff going on in school, but you know, I, I've just had a lot of stuff going on lately, but per very soon I'll be able to make a lot of videos normally again. Now anyways, right here is the cycling road, which you can go into once you have your bike, and you can head down the road. Now, I will go through here later, there's a bunch of trainers, so I'm going to have to dedicate a whole video to that, so for now I'll just leave. And, um, yeah, there's a fisherman down there, but I don't really want to fight him, so... Yeah, let's see. We still have a lot of time left, and we've pretty much done everything in Mauville, so I'm going to come over to this route, Route 118, and do a bit of training. Because, like I said, I'm not really sure that I'm ready to take on the gym right now. So, yeah, um, we're going to battle this lady, then. Now, I think this lady is a lady with the shroomish, which I really hate. I think she has a shroomish and a roselia, but yeah, this shroomish... I don't know if you remember the battle against May earlier, this is kind of the same thing. If that Shroomish gave you trouble, it will probably give you trouble again because it will paralyze you, it will use Leech Seed, and it will use Mega Drain, which are, like, super annoying. It's like the worst combination ever. Um, but yeah, if you just have some strong moves, you could probably kill it. Ugh, or you can get paralyzed. <laughs> but yeah, this thing actually can, I'm not gonna lie, it can give you a lot of trouble if you don't have the, you know, right matchup for it. Most of the time, you should be fine, though. And Goron got to level 18, which is good. Goron's probably going to be my main Pokemon taking on the gym. Because the next gym is Electric-type, but there's also a lot of Steel-types, which are weak to fighting. So yeah, um, I'm going to go back to Ralts for Ozelia. Just because it's weak to Psychic-types. By the way, if you want Roselia, I think you can catch this in like the very next route after Mobville City. So yeah. Let's see how much Confusion can do. I really think it's weird that Roselia has flowers for hands, like, what the heck? Like, really, you have flowers for hands, and it doesn't even have feet, like, it, or, you can't even tell if it has feet. There's, like, a leaf, and there's, like, two little pegs. Like, how does it even walk around with those tiny legs, anyways? Whatever. Oh, dear me, I seem to have lost. Anyways, well, I love doing that hopping thing on my bike. Let's see, we got a fisherman here. I think we're going to grow vile for that. I don't really feel like healing Goron. Alright, so, yeah. Um, I guess if you have any grass or electric type, it should work fine against this dude. Fisherman Wade, he has a Carvana. I always loved how the fishing poles had the Pokeball on the end of it, and I always thought that was pretty clever. Anyways, one bullet seed will probably kill this thing. Yep. Carvana is pretty much like the worst Pokemon for taking hits in the world. <laughs> Which we'll find out after battling Team Aqua a bunch. Alright, that was easy. Now we got one more dude, the guitarist guy here, so I guess I can go... I don't really want to heal, I'm just going to put up Goron. I'll just deal with the paralysis, which is probably a bad idea, but whatever. And he's going to let his melody rock my soul. Guitar... What is a dude with no shirt on with a guitar just, like, doing out on the beach randomly? <laughs> yeah, whatever. See his vital throw, now thunder... Yeah, this guy, I guess, um... If you're not really sure about how you're going to go about being the gym, I guess this guy is sort of like a preview of the gym, because he uses electric types, um, and sort of the same ones that you'll find in there, like Magnemite, basically. I think he has like a Whismer on his team, but yeah, just, it's good training, and also the Cycling Road has Magnemites too, so, you know, if you're not really sure how to take him out, you can, you can just test your team out on those Magnemites, and then that should give you a good idea of, like, what's best to go up against the gym with. At least that's always strategy I would use. And Whisper can probably get killed by this thing too. But yeah, I'll just warn you guys, the next gym can be very, very hard if you don't have um, a ground type, like a Marsh Stomp on your team. If you do, it's going to be really easy, but other than that, it can be hard. Especially if you started with Trico, so... Um, yeah, there's a lot of training you can do around here. I'm not sure if I'm going to go to the gym right now and have it be like really challenging, or if I'm going to go do some training first, but I'll see. And, yeah, there we go. I think that's all the training we're going to have to do in this video. And, yeah, we've pretty much seen everything in Mauville City, so I will see you all next time. Stay tuned for more.